Heart disease is a leading cause of death for adults in the United States. The good news, heart disease, for the most part, can be prevented by addressing the risk factors. Here to tell us more about Cano Health's healthy heart program is Dr. Juan Rivera. Welcome to the show. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure to be here. Those facts, is, is heart disease, is, is that deadly? Is that big of a problem right now for America? It has been the leading cause of death for decades. Mm -hmm. Heart attacks, yep. strokes. We need to be able to prevent those. A lot of people think those cannot be prevented. You're wrong. You can prevent heart attacks. And that is your Healthy Hearts program. Tell me more about it. So what we do is we understand everyone's risk factors, diabetes, mm -hmm. cholesterol, blood pressure, your weight, your exercise level. We understand that first. But mm -hmm. then we go and look inside your body okay. with something called a heart scan. And we look to see how much plaque you have in your coronary arteries. You might be developing plaque, and it's a silent process. Mm -hmm. You don't know it. But by doing those advanced tests, we understand your risk. And then we can establish lifestyle or med uh, lifestyle changes mm -hmm. or, uh, or medications when we need to to make sure that we decrease your risk of having a heart attack. Tell me about the screening process. So you, how, how are you testing for plaque? I'm lying down. There's a machine going over here. What's the screening process? It's very easy. Mm -hmm. It's a CT scan from here to here. Okay. Very, very little radiation. It takes less than five minutes. Mm -hmm. And when it's over, I can tell you something called the coronary calcium score. You want a zero. But a lot of people have plaque. It's the most common disease process mm -hmm. in the U.S. If you have a score from 1 to 99, you have mild plaque. 100 to 399, you have moderate. When your coronary calcium score is more than 400, your risk of having a heart attack is the same as someone who already had a heart attack. Wow. And you can figure this out. Okay, let's go over some simple strategies that people watching right now can improve their lifestyle. So when it comes to exercise, what's a simple strategy people 10, can do? 10,000 steps a day. That's it. Ten, at, at the minimum. Yes. 10,000 steps a day. Diet. Uh, diet, I think everyone has to decide what is the best diet for that particular individual. Mm -hmm. If you ask me, Dr. Juan, for coronary artery disease, to decrease plaque, to reverse heart disease, which is the one that is the best scientifically proven? I have to say plant-based. Okay. Not everyone wants to follow a plant-based diet, but that's, that's what the data shows. The last one, because everyone's so busy, when it comes to sleep, what's a simple trick when it comes to sleep? Because sleep is such a key thing. Routine. 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 Make sure that you're going to bed at the same time every night. You're trying to wake up at the same time mm -hmm. every uh, day. Forget about your phone, computers. You know, try to avoid programming that it's going to keep you uh, awake. Yes. Just relax. Make sure your room is at a very good temperature in the 67 degrees, 68 uh, degrees. I love it. Exercise throughout the day. And sleep. Meditation works. You need seven hours to eight hours of sleep. Dr. Juan, thank you so much. These are great tips. We appreciate it. Thank you, my thank friend. You. And thank you to Kano Health for sponsoring this segment. For more information, call 702-848-2875 or visit kanohealth.com.